G'day YouTube, it's Marty from Music Video Muster. I've got another top five video for you today and this time I want to talk about my favorite compilation music DVDs. Let's go. Welcome back to Music Video Muster. This is the channel where we believe that music is better on DVD. So what I want to talk about today is a specific type of music DVD that I really like, and that is the compilation DVD. Now, I really love to watch live concerts of my favorite bands, but even better than that, I think, is to watch the music videos. Music videos can really enhance the song, especially if they're well thought out and well produced. I've got quite a lot of DVDs on my shelf, which are the collected music videos of a particular artist, but it's really nice to get a whole range of different songs collected in the one place. So in this video today, I'm going to count down my top five favorite compilation music DVDs. All right, so number five on my list to kick off this countdown is Indie Anthems, volume one. This is the first of three volumes, and so far I only have volume one. I picked this one up recently when I went to Brisbane, which is the capital city of the state where I live, and they've got a really great secondhand music shop there called The Rocking Horse. So shout out to The Rocking Horse. I picked this one up for $5, and it's got 27 tracks. Some of them are Australian, some of them are American or British. So I'll just read out the first five tracks to give you an idea of what kind of music you can expect on this compilation. So we've got Disco 2000 by Pulp, All Right by Supergrass, I See You Baby Groove Amada, Heroin Girl by Everclear, and Karma Police by Radiohead. So it's that kind of mainstream, slightly alternative genre of rock and pop, which was popular during the early 2000s. And one of the main reasons I really like this disc is because it has Jeff Buckley's Everybody Here Wants You. Now this song was released posthumously after Jeff Buckley died. And the video clip isn't great, but it's nice to know that I've got it on DVD. No. Okay, so number four, I want to mention Triple J, Hottest 100 of all time. This DVD came out in 2009. For those of you who don't live in Australia or aren't aware of Triple J, Triple J is a radio station, which is a subsidiary of our national broadcaster here, the ABC. Triple J plays music which is directed at younger people and for many of us growing up in the 90s, it was the only way to get our fix of alternative music. So one thing that Triple J is famous for is every year they conduct a poll and they ask people what their favorite songs were from that particular year. They compile all the results and they make a list of the top 100 songs for every year. But this particular poll, the hottest 100 of all time, was special because it marked the end of an era. It contains a lot of music that I really connected with, especially during my years as a student in high school and university. So reading out the first five tracks on this list to give you an idea of what's on here. Radiohead, Paranoid Android. Rage Against the Machine, Killing in the Name. Muse, Knights of Cydonia. Jeff Buckley, Hallelujah. And Joy Division, Love Will Tear Us Apart. Altogether, there are 39 tracks on this DVD and they're all the official music videos. And I highly recommend this one if you like this kind of music. Three. All right, coming in at number three, we've got a release by Rage. Now, I'm not talking about Rage Against the Machine. When I was talking about the previous DVD, I mentioned Triple J, which was a radio station connected to the Australian Broadcasting Corporation. Well, the ABC also had a TV show that we could watch every weekend, and I'm not even sure whether it still exists. Maybe it does. So every Saturday morning, when you turn on the TV and tune into ABC, Rage was on. And Rage showed 
the top 40 charts. And also, if you watched it late at night, say on a Friday night, you could see some really interesting and weird video clips. Now, ABC's Rage has released quite a few DVDs, and this particular release is called Rage Gets Animated. So there are 38 tracks altogether on this DVD, and every single track features some kind of animation in the video clip. So I think it's a very cool concept for grouping various kinds of music into a compilation. Let me read out the first five tracks on this disc for you. The Dissociatives, Horror with Eyeballs. Radiohead, Paranoid Android. Josh Pike, Middle of the Hill. Josh Pike is an Australian singer-songwriter and if you want to know more about him, I made a video for my top five Australian music DVDs. Check that one out. John Butler Trio, Good Excuse, another really great Australian musician, and Red Hot Chili Peppers, Behind the Sun. I think that this is a really great DVD to have. It represents a diverse range of genres, but again, focusing more on the alternative rock that was popular in the early 2000s. The best video on here, I think, is track 28, Linkin Park, Points of Authority. So this is the video for Points of Authority as taken from the reanimation album. But it's really cool to have the remix of Points of Authority on DVD. It's a very cool concept. There's some nice animation and it's a good remix too. Okay, coming in at number two, I want to talk about Sound and Motion, Volume 1. Now, it says Volume 1, but as far as I know, they didn't make any other volumes, just this one. This release is brought out by Palm Pictures, which I think is somewhat of a boutique label. Palm Pictures also made a really cool series called The Work of Directors series. It's a double box set and I'll make a video about that another time. Sound and Motion Volume 1 is a collection of electronic music videos. According to the cover of this DVD, the genres represented here are house, techno, breaks and drum and bass. So if you're a fan of electronic music, then you'll really appreciate this. And I really like this release because it's so different from the other items that I have, which are mostly focused on alternative rock. And it's all in 5.1 surround sound, which is really great because when you play this kind of music on your sound system, you want to crank it up and you want to hear a really good sound. Let me read out the first five tracks on this disc. We've got Chemical Brothers, Block Rock and Beats, Fatboy Slim, The Rockefeller Skank, Jackknife Lee, Bursting Off the Backbeat, Josh Wink, Simple Man, The Crystal Method, Busy Child. Now my favorite track on this DVD, I think, is The Crystal Method. I've known this track for a long time, but I never actually knew who the artist was or what the title of the song was. So when I put it on and uh, this song came on, I was so happy that I finally got that song on DVD in my collection. Wow. All right, so coming in at number one, I've got a really special DVD. This one is called the Hammer and Tongs Collection. Hammer and Tongs is the name of a group of music video directors, and they have done some amazing, amazing work. They're based in the UK, I believe, and here are some of the songs that are collected on this DVD. Blur, Coffee and TV. Supergrass, Pumping on Your Stereo. REM, Imitation of Life. Vampire Weekend, A-Punk. And Badly Drawn Boy, Spitting in the Wind. On this disc, there are also videos for Beck, Radiohead, Eels, Moloko, Bentley Rhythm Ace, Fatboy Slim, Pulp, and the wannadies. So when we're talking about music videos, you have two types, I think. There's your very plain stock standard promotional videos. Then there are other music videos which are super creative, very well thought out, very conceptual, and just add so much more to the song. And that is the kind of video that Hammer and Tongs makes. They're super creative and every video is a pleasure to watch. So I got this copy 
on eBay from the UK and I'm pretty sure I got it from Rare Waves for a really good price, brand new. So it's a bargain. And inside, there's actually some bonus stuff. So here's a little sample of the kind of artwork that is included. This one uh, is the concept for Fatboy Slim's video right here, right now, with the uh, evolution from, you know, the marine life into the fat humans. Now, as well as the music videos, there's some really cool bonus features on this disc. There's some interviews, there's some little mini documentaries, and I highly recommend the Hammer and Tongs collection. Go check it out. Okay, guys, so that's the end of this video, and I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope I've given you some ideas for your own music collection. If I've missed anything, if there's some music video compilation DVDs that you have and that you like, please let me know in the comments. I'm always looking for new items to add. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and share, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, make some time to enjoy watching your music. See ya.